Yeah, shout out to Curbster. Oh, Curbster is the warm up. Okay, Curbster obviously plays P uh, PT. The warm up, one of the best. Uh, I, I feel lied to about his name. Ban PS2? I know. Oh no, I meant Curbster, the Pokemon trainer. Oh, playing. <laughs> That's not Kirby. Uh, yeah. Audio, yeah. We don't need it. We we know it. Yeah, just start. Okay, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, okay, there it is. Um, this is actually be kind of a difficult match. The world has just been powering up like crazy recently, but uh, I actually have a few characters play in a bit. Honestly, he's kind of putting up a fight to me. Okay, I like it, I like it, I like it. Yeah. That was kind of a funny little... Kind of what? Just a funny little air dodge. He, like, land jumped up there, then wave landed down to try and bait something out and then punish it, but... Curbster not giving him anything. Yeah, Curbster... I feel like Curbster is starting to get the down this. Down throw into down special psych. I'm not gonna get quite yet though. The curbster is uh, very much still kicking in. I like to swap the Charizard at this high percent. Yeah, oh wow, actually <laughs> able to get that down tilt the pivot grab? Looks for down throw nair, I'm not. Curbster kind of popped off a little bit down air, but it doesn't get the spike. That's actually so sad. But seriously, that was such a clean string there from Curbster. Just had read after read and was able to execute uh, on those punishes so effectively. And just continues to be lacking this damage. Whoa! That is unfortunate. Yeah, that seemed like it was surviving. Another good read coming in, though. Yeah, Curbs is playing super well right now. I. Not a big fan of the uh, up smash at ledge, but you know what? He makes it work. The warm up not actually able to find that kill combo. What is that? Okay, the Waveland jab lock into up B. All right, the warm up. I see you. That was kind of nice. Uh oh, grab on a big heavy character. Stops the combo though. Is he up B? Yeah, he's chill. Yeah, and that move does have super armor, so you know if you're not able to bait it out and space properly you will just get hit with it and it's a very powerful kill option wait no double jump curbster lost his jump okay but that was all right I, I don't really know what happened there like the tether just decided not to grab i don't know if it like hit the luigi plunger or what happened yeah. but that was interesting i'm not entirely sure either that was uh I suppose we can attribute that to the warm-up just getting a good edge guard with the the plunger, and because of that, like Curbster must have just been Pokemon just far enough GG. away to where the uh, tether will grab. I think that's super unfortunate, but Curbster, as long as Curbster can keep a cool head, uh, I think they have a good shot of taking this. Um, yeah, I think they do have a really good shot. Especially on a really big stage like this, you don't have to run around with. I think this is fine kind of thing. Curbster's movement is so clean. Curbster's yeah, I mean, it looked like he was super in control of that game for a while there, but. Oh, no. I feel like. Curbs just has such a good lead every time, and then one unfortunate thing happens, and he just loses a stock for it. Yeah, let's see. Plunger is just not finding their marks. Uh, it is pretty unfortunate so far, though, that up special there missing his mark again. A great read on the neutral getup. Warm up is using that a lot, and Curbs are starting to get the punishes. Back. Back to a bit of neutral. This is still a very even game so far. Oh, uh, here's a grab. Could be eating my words. Gets the jab lock. Not gonna be getting much out of the uh out of that though. Okay. Interesting use I of the side B there. If that was a uh a misfire, that would have been very, very good. 
Alright, now, the one who's just kind of spacing out with these neutral beasts, he doesn't have to be the one to approach, but he whips oh. a grab and eats a Charizard back here in the face. Loses his stock at, like, 70%, and now, all of a sudden, you know, it, it felt like the story of the game was Curbs would get a lead, and then something would just be incredibly unlucky. He'd lose his stock off of a small air action. But now the tables have turned, and it's actually the warm-up losing his stock incredibly early to one little mistake, and now... Curbs has the lead once again. It's up to him to be able to finish this game. Doesn't get hit by the dash attack. These fireballs are just making it so hard for him to actually approach. Yeah, seriously. 164% downer, but it's still not enough. I like that up smash there by the warm-up. Closed out Kirkstar in second stock, but uh, not out of it quite yet. They're a, a very talented player, and uh, still got uh -oh. something in the kettle, but to up the shower spot, and now he's punished from Kirkstar. Got the warm up off stage. Ooh. Okay. Hey, Curb, sorry. Respect. So cool. Yeah, just a really good edge guard, covering everything. Um, not letting uh, the warm up get away with any green missiles. Um, straight up, just getting a huge BP down there on shield. Uh, really, really good there by Curb, sorry. Um. I'm gonna guess if I. Uh, what would Curve Starry ban here? Um. Maybe banning something like. Oh, I don't even know. I, I, I have no idea what, what a good stage would be for the warm up here. Um. I'm gonna guess probably just banning like FD and Kalos. Um. Yeah. And we're probably just gonna be going somewhere like that. Uh. Special is gonna be the counter pick for the warm up. Just wants to small trainer. horizontal blast zones. And, uh, yeah, obviously you can get a lot of mileage out of getting stage or control of center stage as well. Yeah, I see the benefits for Smashville for Luigi. I feel like this stage, he's either Luigi. going to have a lead and it's going to be impossible to approach him, or he's going to get camped. And he's not going to be able to find a way in to actually get the grab. Uh, the large center platform like that gives so much space to avoid playing around the grabs while also playing in his face somewhat just so you can jump in to punish things. So the warm ups going to have to be very careful with where he's throwing these grabs at, how he's positioning, because if Carbs just plays around this platform, I think it's going to be incredibly difficult for him. Yeah. So far, again, a pretty even game from Sorry off stage. Nearly gets clipped by the plunger in the down air, but uh, we're, we're still pretty even. Uh, um, Sorry was sticking with the Squirtle. I think that is their weakest of the three for one. Um, so it is nice to see this watch back to a more familiar pick. Oh, down, I get spiked. Tries for another one with the dice. Okay, Curbs has to find a way out of the corner, but instead of that, he finds his way to the top of the blast zone. Down throw into up B, going to get the warm up a lead here in A5%, but not the worst position for the warm up. Yeah, and now actually the position starts getting a little bit better, just getting more and more damage. Curbs, sorry, really needs to find this stock, but up is not making it easy. Oh, smoke too soon. Okay, that reversal there. <laughs> yeah, warm up, taking a second on the platform. Calm, cool, and collected like a cucumber. Okay, I like the trade of the jabs, but he does it from a spot where Curb Sorry is able to jump, or rather, air dodge away. This is going to just be a reset to neutral. Both players try to find their opening. We're seeing a lot of Razor Leafs come out from Curb Sorry, but. Another down throw into the uppy from the warm up. One stock remaining for Curb Sorry's winner's bracket. Yeah, really gotta get something going here. Just getting some damage with that down throw into uh, up special. But uh, it just feels like part of the momentum that Curb Sorry had in that game one is just starting to be. It's just not there anymore. Uh, the warm up is really starting to take this damage. Oh. Back airs. This damage is so, so, so real. 
That was a really good combo to recognize the DI from Curb Story was not going to allow him to finish that combo to a kill. Instead, mixes it up, gets his damage, but Curb Story able to catch the getup with a forward smash, even this out one stock apiece. And we know Ivy Store can take early stocks, for, especially from a character with a recovery like Luigi. It can be very difficult to actually get the recovery. Okay, Plunger just putting up a huge wall for Starry. Rising back air makes it back onto ledge, but one good hit that up smash hit. from the warm up closes out game number three.